the baseball as an infielder is important is because we want to create momentum into our throw. Especially as the players get older and the fields get bigger, it's difficult to just throw from a stationary position. We always want to keep our feet moving. The next drill we're going to do here is what we like to call the line drill. A common mistake you'll see most players make is when their coach yells out after them, charge the baseball, they'll run right to the ball and stop their feet. We want to try to eliminate stopping the feet or having that pause because we always want to have consistent motion or movement going towards our target. As you can see, we have three baseballs lined up on the ground with a line drawn in between each of them. This is an easy drill to do out in the dirt. You can draw a line and set up three balls just like this. When we work on approaching the ground ball or charging the ground ball, we want to try to stay to the right side of the baseball. That's what we like to call left foot timing. The reason we stay to the right side of the baseball is so that when we field it, our motion and our movements are taking us towards first base or towards the direction of our throw. The idea here is to stay on the right side of the line until that ball comes to your glove. So just like this, you'll have your players line up in their fielding position. As they're getting ready to attack the second baseball, they'll work on the right side of the line. As they cross, the ball touches their glove. They reset. Work on the right side of the line. As they cross, the ball touches their glove. This is putting them in a good athletic position to make a strong throw towards first base. The next step to this drill would be to line up our feet towards our target. I'm in a good athletic position. I approach the ground ball. I tap. Skateboard. We want to make sure that after we field the ground ball, we hop on that skateboard, or as we discussed earlier, line up those checkpoints with our target. Our foot, our knee, our hip, elbow, and the back of our glove are in a good strong position to make an accurate throw. So again, we'll get set on the first baseball, we'll work on the right side of the line, tap, skateboard, reset. Work on the right side of the line, tap, Skateboard, and this is keeping your players' feet moving, attacking the ground ball, and getting their momentum going towards first base.